three apps. Apps? Yeah, we got apps. We got three apps. Welcome to the Daily Appster. The short time we spend together today is devoted to iOS applications, either for the iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad. Not just any applications, but free ones. I'm James, and I sort through all the terrible application muck to find the gems you've been searching for. This is the Daily Appster for June 20th, 2011. These first two apps I have for you today are both freeappaday.com apps. The first one is called Breitling Reno Air Races The Game. Breitling Reno Air Races The Game. I think I'm saying that right. And in this application, you are racing airplanes. You can kind of do this in single player or multiplayer. You've got this plane, and it controls really well. It's got motion controls, you know, tilting around, and then there's also some on-screen controls. But it flies really well. You're able to kind of dive down really low, get as close to the ground as you can. The closer to the ground you get, the faster you go. I also tend to smash into the ground quite a bit. It's got like an afterburner that you can use until the oil gets too hot. Very cool. If you like racing games, check this out. Breitling Reno Air Races the Game. The other free app at day.com app is Maya Pyramid. Maya Pyramid. These guys have another application I talked about at one point, and that was called Cleopatra's Pyramid. This is very similar. It's a sort of speed solitaire where you're trying to get rid of all of these cards that are out on the table. The way you do that is by adding them up to 11. So every group of cards that you select has to add up to 11, and if they do, then they disappear, and it opens up more cards behind them. And the kicker is that you have to complete all of this before the timer runs out. Um, As you go, you're actually building this pyramid. It's very cool. If you like solitaire games, check out Maya Pyramid. Next app is called Tonalverse. Tonalverse. There's also a tonal verse for iPad. And I'm just going to read what they say here. They say, Tonal verse is a new ambient universe generator, allowing you to distract your mind by creating ambient tones and infinite sequences in an abstract graphical universe. That sounds pretty awesome, right? So you start it up, and you can tap anywhere on the screen. It creates these tonal spheres, and you're able to kind of grab those, drag them around, throw them if you want. You can put walls up so they kind of just bounce around. Uh, You can enable gravity so you can turn the device and they kind of fall in the direction that you've turned it. They just make this ambient music. It's very cool if you're into that sort of thing. Check out Tonal Verse and Tonal Verse for iPad. Next up is an application called Versaries. Versaries, as in anniversaries, but it's just the versary part. And this is a super weird application. It uses the Versaries interactive time machine to figure out strange milestones in your life. You'll put in, you know, your your birthday and if you're married, when you got married, and just kind of significant events in your life, and it'll give you really odd milestones. Like, like on October 5th, 2011, I will have been married for 200 million seconds. And on November 19th, 2012, my wife will have been married to me for 25% of her life. And other weird kind of milestones like that. It's just put in some information and just see what comes out. Check out Versaries. Next up is Color Plus. And that's like the plus symbol. Color Plus. And I talked about Color with an exclamation point before. That one used to be a paid app, but they made it free and just added you know, I ads to it. And they made this premium application, Color Plus, uh, which is now on sale. So if you don't remember, this allows you to take a photograph from your library, and then you're able to kind of put it all in black and white, and then you're able to just color in certain sections of the photograph. So if you want something to really stand out, if somebody's wearing this, like, ridiculous purple tie, well, you can make everything everything black and white, and then that purple tie will stand out, or, you know, whatever it is you want to do. It's really very cool. Definitely like this. If you're into photography applications, check out Color Plus. And the last app I have for you today is called Recycle Hero. Recycle Hero. You're starting this recycling business. You've got this conveyor belt and several tubs that you're sorting these uh, recycled goods that are coming through. And you start out just with a, with a plastic and a paper bin, but as you go, you're able to buy more bins, and different kinds of items start coming down the chute. It gets pretty hectic, but it's very fun. I will say the trick, as far as the campaign mode goes is combos. you got to combo this, because I was sorting stuff forever before I realized you could select more than one plastic item and then throw it in the tub. You could select a whole bunch 
and that'll get you more money, and that will enable you to progress uh, faster. So, word to the wise, combos will help you out a lot. Uh, this is a very fun game, Recycle Hero. That is all the apps I have for you today. I did want to mention that I got a voicemail from a very nice listener um, who listens to the show every day with her son. And she is on the lookout for a timeline application. I'm not exactly sure what she's needing as far as this timeline application goes, but I did a search for it. I couldn't really find anything, but I wanted to let her know that I am on the lookout for it. And if anybody has any suggestions for timeline applications, uh, please let me know. You can follow the show and find links to all the apps I've talked about at thebigskillet.com. If you'd like to email me for any reason, you can do that at thedailyappster at gmail.com. And I'm on Twitter at twitter.com slash thedailyappster. Thanks to iCactus for the opening and closing music. Until next time, enjoy your free apps.